Hey everybody, Proofy TV X, Common Sense. This is a hard one, man, because I, I, I fucked with T-Pain, man. I fucked with T-Pain, man. And hearing what he said about two nigga, have you bumped your fucking head? You need to put that goddamn liquor down, nigga. You got to put that shit down. What the fuck are you talking about? Tupac? He wouldn't be shit? He's been dead? <laughs> Nigga, I don't know if you're doing this to stir up some shit, to goddamn be looked at, but this is the wrong goddamn topic, my nigga. This is the wrong way to go about it. Are you serious? Pox songs are fitting into these times now. The ones he wrote way back in the 90s, early 90s, are right now what we're living through. Timeless. And he ain't no lyricist. Have you heard, because you got me questioning, have you even heard Tupac music? Or are you just saying something? I, I, don't, I just don't get it. You fucked up on this one, man. You fucked up on this one. I just don't understand what the fuck you was thinking. Was you drunk? Because you know academics get down with it, so. I just don't understand what the fuck. Why would you say that? Why would you say that he wouldn't be shit? He'd be chewed up. By who? Who? Name some people. Because all the big dogs, the one that's big now, like the Jay-Z's and shit. Pop was on their fucking helmet. So who? And I know you can't be talking about no goddamn... drill music or no goddamn mumble rap i know you're not talking about them type of people what are you who are you saying that will, can, that will destroy him who who you tell me he could he, he won't be um, relevant right now with the man you sound so good you need to slap your goddamn self for getting out of line you need to slap your goddamn self for getting out of line every rapper is a fucking poet Everyone. Even the real, real poets back then was rapping. They just didn't put it together right, but they was rapping. And it pissed me off too, man. I did not want to have to ever... This nigga said... He probably wouldn't be shit. If it was social media back then, he wouldn't have been shit. Without social media, nigga, niggas knew Tupac. Without social media. Without it. You hear what I'm saying, right? Without it. You're so goddamn ridiculous, man. I just can't believe, I don't know if you had like a, um, some type of mental, mental break at that point or you was upset about something or the lick, I don't know. But you need to goddamn. <laughs> I don't even know, man. I don't even fucking know what to tell you, man. And there's a lot of people feel that way. You just dis disrespect it. The whole fucking 90s, damn near. Same way. Lil Wayne and them was banging out them goddamn. That's the same shit too. If you go, you hear so many people want Tupac shit. He so many features on that shit. It was people. What late nineties, early two thousands, that was putting him on that shit, and he not being there, just playing his music and putting them on that shit. And you sitting here. 
straight face saying what you said? Have you lost your mind? If so, you can go find it and place it back. What the fuck you thinking about? What you talking about? Man, I can't believe it. Uh, Snoop's still around. I mean, he was there with him. So what, what, what? Is, did that go to Snoop too? Dr. Dre was there. Did, did that go to them too? E-40 then was there. Did, did that go to them too? What, I, I don't get what you're trying to say. That's what I'm saying. It sounds like a goddamn diss. I'm trying not to say, I'm trying not to think it's a goddamn all out diss. I just want to know, I, I don't understand what you say when you say that. I think you need to go back and, and, and refresh your mind and listen to the shit that he's saying and compare it to this day. People like that, that have that short amount of time, they know they gotta, they gotta hurry up and get all that shit out that they need to get out. Same thing with Big, so are, you, are you saying the same thing with Big too? Or is it just pop? He had a short span of fame, my nigga. And in that short span, he did how many films? What? Juice. Uh, another one, too. Gang related. Um, what else? It was another one, too, with uh, Mickey Rory. Can't remember that goddamn movie. Um, Juice. I said juice already. Um, Poetic Justice. I mean, a few, man. In his, in, in, in his short time, man. And not only that, but movies. I mean, I said movie, But uh, music, forever. In that short amount of time. I want to know who are you comparing? Who, 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 what artists are you comparing saying that would destroy him? That he would be fucking, you said destroyed. Yeah, that's right. You did. You said fucking destroyed. God damn it. God damn it, Pain. Oh. Can you imagine? Michael Jackson saying that shit to James Brown. You can't. You can't because it wouldn't happen. <sighs> Something got into you that day, man. I don't know what the fuck happened or what the fuck was going on before y'all start goddamn taping. I don't know. But I know you done bumped your motherfucking head and you need to be in a goddamn mental facility to see what the fuck is your issue and how can you compare whatever you're trying to compare to a pot. No lyrics. So you never heard shed so many tears. You never heard better days. You never heard change. None of this. You never heard none of that. Grand's got a baby. You never heard none of that shit. None of it. All eyes on me. Machiavelli. Thug life. Nothing you heard about. Don't you sing? You sing, correct? So how the fuck are you talking about some lyrics? You sing. <sighs> just, just, yeah, man. Just uh, show us who you talking about. Who can, who would compare to that? I'll be looking forward to seeing some shit like that. Because you done lost your goddamn mind, man. You done lost your motherfucking mind. Thomas, sir.